Hi, let's see like how to fix TV ML kit error domain error three on Apple TV. Are you getting this particular error TV ML kit error domain three error three on the Apple TV? Apple TV is a revolutionary device that provides a seamless experience for the users to access the world of content. However, with this technology, issue can arise and one of the most common issues encountered by the Apple TV user is error launching application. The operation couldn't be completed. That is TV ML kit error domain three error three. Either you are a user or the developer both covered in this particular video. This particular video we will try to explore the reasons why this particular error occurs and we also provide the solutions with the step by step in order to fix this particular issue. Let's see like what causes TV ML kit error domain error 3 on Apple TV. Whenever you face this kind of error you would see the screen like this. For the users the error launching application the operation couldn't be completed error on the Apple TV can be caused by the several factors including issues with your network connection outdated software or the compatibility issues with the TV ML kit framework for the developers TV ML kit error domain error 3 occur when there was no connection to your remote JavaScript files host your TV device is not the same local host as your simulator local host. You should access the JS files host by IP and make sure they both are on the same network. Let's see like how to fix the TV ML kit error domain 3 error 3 on Apple TV for the users. In order to fix this we have to follow some of the methods or the solutions. The first method is restart your Apple TV to restart your Apple TV, simply press and hold the menu button on your remote until the light on the Apple TV flashes. Then release the button, wait for the Apple TV to restart. Once the device is restarted, try launching the application again. The second method is check for the software updates. To check for the software updates in your TV, go to the setting systems and software updates. If a software update is available, download and install the update. After the update is installed, restart your Apple TV and then try launching the application again. The third method is remove and reinstall the application. To remove an application from your Apple TV, go to the settings application and the manage applications. Select the application you wish to remove and then choose delete. Then reinstall the application from the App Store on your Apple TV. Wait for a few hours. If you have tried all the above steps, it is possible that the issue is caused by the temporary server issues. In this case, wait for a few hours may resolve this issue. Waiting for the few hours may resolve this issue. After waiting for a few hours, restart your Apple TV and then try launching the application again. Explain the, we have explained some of the steps in the detail. Let's see like how to fix the TV ML kit error domain error three on the Apple TV for the developers. The first method is host your entire client application in the cloud on one solution to fix the TV ML kit error domain error 3 on the Apple TV for the developer is to host your entire client app somewhere in the cloud. You can use a hosting service such as Amazon Web Services or the Heroku to host your client app. Once you have uploaded your client app to host to the hosting service, provide the URL of the hosted files in your Apple TV code. The second method is connect both your Apple TV and your machine to the same network. After another solution is to connect both the Apple TV and your machine to the same network and host your client app publicly in the local network. To do this, you need to start an Apache server on your machine using the terminal. Open the terminal on your Mac and enter the following command 
sudo apache ctl start once the apache server is running open a web browser on your machine and type in your ip address by default you should see a page with the content it works your files are located in this particular location library slash web server slash documents you can put all your client code in this location test the path in the browser by hitting the your ip address and the relative paths if everything is working correctly specify same path in your apple tv native code and deploy it to the actual device make sure that both your device and your machine are connected to the safe network okay so that's all about this thank you